Alrighty, you guys, welcome back to a brand new episode here on The Ankle. Hey, Ember. So, I hope everyone is having a great day. Thank you so much for tuning on in. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments. Like and subscribe, become a channel member. So, for today's video, we're going to be taking a look at three recent TikToks from our girl Amber. She's definitely, you know, back to her <laughs> usual ways. Um, I have a feeling Girlie had some of these just saved up in the drafts and, you know, she was like, I want to post these. So let's just break up with Valentine. But yeah, um, I mean, she's just, you know, going to talk her crap and going to do the same old, same old that she did during every single breakup. So, you know, it's running the course, I guess. But yeah, I'm always saying time, guys. We will check the comments, of course, of course. And yeah, let's just dive right on in, shall we? I don't relate to you. Oh, Lord, girl. <laughs> Lord. It's looking a little rough, right? Right? <laughs> <laughs> it looked like her eyelid got stuck. Girl, you'd never treat yourself this shitty. You ate yourself to 700 pounds. So you've done far worse to yourself than anyone else could do. I'm sorry. You made me hate this city. Oh no. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> Not her glitchy eyes. Even her, like, you know, when she's in her, mm, I'm a bad bitch, who would ever cheat on me, kind of, like, attitude. It's just so, like, ugh. Ugh. She's probably, like, thinking to herself, like, Amber, it's okay, all right? Even Beyonce got cheated on, all right? If Beyonce can get cheated on, it can happen to anyone. <laughs> And all this for someone you never met face to face, dude? Like, really? Really? I don't know. I don't know, you guys. What if it was just like a talking phase and then this person just completely up and ghosted her? I could believe it. I really could. Like, I'm not going to speak for the lesbian community, but in the gay community, ghosting is very common, unfortunately. I think that's just how it is in the online dating realm anyways, but... I have a feeling she just got ghosted, but who knows? <laughs> who knows? The eye roll always takes me out. No, for real. Eye rolling. Okay, but her face card never declines. She's so pretty. Eye roll. Eye roll, dude. Also, like, by no means am I condoning that anyone goes to her page and comments anything, nothing, of the sort. That being said, it's very easy to deter people's opinions uh, in the comments. You can tell that these people are just randomly finding her from these TikToks and just watching her videos. Like, I don't know, we always get a wave of people like this though. Like, do you guys remember the French audience? There's always a wave of people that come in and then they very quickly realize um, no, it's not just people being dramatic or hating on this girl for no reason. Like, a lot of the criticism she gets has absolutely nothing to do with the superficial dumb stuff, you know? I mean, we make our jokes, absolutely, because, sorry, it's funny. But most of our criticism comes from her actions, not what she looks like. I could give two shits. In my opinion, Amberlynn will always be ugly because of who she is. Not like how she looks, how she dresses, all the cheap crap jewelry that she buys, the fact that she doesn't wash. None of that makes her a disgusting person. You know, it's just an added factor. Like, oh, of course. She's vile and disgusting. She's irredeemable, okay? She could become the skinniest little fashion model there ever was. The world's first five foot two fashion model. <laughs> I don't care. I don't care. If she's got that rank ass attitude, dude, who cares? 
My little Ozempic queen. What's little about that? Which city? Girl, everyone. Every single one. Why did I get here so early? You deserve so much better, queen. <laughs> she deserves herself, all right? That is it. <laughs> Lexington, LMFAO. Is <laughs> she back to hating Beck again? Probably. What happened? Single lad? Hey, twin. <laughs> <laughs> Girl, oh. Wouldn't want to be twinning with Amber Lynn. Hey, Queen, I love you so much. OMG, I missed you on my For You page. Gorgeous as always. What is with all of these girls? It's all girls, too. Like, you notice that? There's not a single male commenting this stuff. Not even a gay one. How did you get so good at eyeliner? It always looks great. She sat around for 10 years doing nothing, dude. She had plenty of time to practice, all right? She's good at at least something from those years wasted. Let's enter the Sassy Lynn era. Let's not. Oh my god, it's so freaking annoying. Beautiful as always. Sure, girl. And like I've said before, I think these people are just trying to be nice, you know? Like, if I didn't know anything of Amber and she crossed my For You page, I would probably be more sympathetic, you know? Like, way more. But, you know, we know who we're dealing with. So, like, that's why I'm understanding that these people just aren't aware. There are a lot of very ignorant people on TikTok, all right? <laughs> Social media in general. So, it doesn't surprise me. Felt this, blah, blah, blah. Queen, do I have a chance? Definitely not. <laughs> the eyeliner slays. Not tagging Mitzi. Oh my god. Guys, she's so pretty. What the hell are you all fighting her for? Mm, yeah, okay. Earrings are giving. <sighs> Gorge. Queen, queen. I think this relates to the wifey lore. Uh, it relates to the lore of literally every single caretaker. I missed your content so much, said no one ever. Mother. <laughs> Dude, no. Okay, so there's the first gay that pops up. No, definitely not giving mother. Yes, Amber. You would treat yourself shitty. We've seen it. <laughs> oh, great. So people are now sliding into her DMs. Wonderful. Karina about to have a field day. I mean, probably. Valentine did something, huh? Well, I mean, can they really do something if they don't exist? The eye roll, I am in tears. Kicker is, she does talk shit about you on the internet, lol. Yeah, she does. She is right now. Like, what? what is all this? The old sit and wiggle, my favorite move. Yo. <laughs> Cringe. Agreed. What's that thing dangling off your ear? It's probably a tag. Skin tag. Did your Insta DM girly break up with you? This is a filter, LMAO. Don't be fooled. You treat yourself shittier, though. Kaying yourself with food. Damn. I'm surprised I didn't get taken down off TikTok. That word... TikTok's very strict with what words you can use. When they give you... Oh my god. Why... Why did I fall for it? <laughs> Where is this love of your life, Valentine? Yeah, because I can't eat like that. We don't relate. <laughs> Blood, you're on the verge of death. <laughs> the smugness. Oh, good lord. Amberlynn, please post more on TikTok. I, if she went live on TikTok, dude. Oh, my god. The signature Amberlynn eye roll is what we stand. Sure, dude. It literally got stuck in her head. You can never make me hate you, Amber. Yeah, like I've said before, if you can hear that this girl has done all of the vile, nasty things that she has over the years, and you can think to yourself that there are still redeeming qualities, then this channel ain't for you. So, bye-bye. <laughs> Pierce the eyebrow, girly. It's gotta be Valentine at this point. Who the hell do you think it is? Like, come on, let's be so for real. Who the hell would she be talking about? My god. Sorry. Sorry, but like, this is what I mean when I say there's a lot of ignorant people on <laughs> social media. Lipstick is running. That's my snake bite scar. I had to zoom in big time, you know, like when you're inspecting craters on the moon, you gotta zoom in. That's what I had to do. You can see the holes in her lips. So she still has scars there, dude. Ugh. Imagine, like, how much worse she looks in person then sorry but like it's true we haven't seen those scars 
noticeably ever truthfully because she always has so many filters on and her face is also just that big but like holding that chin up pretty high huh she's gotta she has to show off the choker see you valentine in our breakup era is this why you couldn't move up a dose Mm, i doubt it and just imagine her not being able to up the dose and then being broken up with (laughs) oh i bet girly was fighting hard to not binge oh she definitely did one of your eyes got stuck huh (laughs) the eyes over the comments peekaboo girl girly flops feeling edgy today I don't even like your content, but you're actually Gorge. No, she's not, Liz. Okay, grow up. Amber is so naturally funny. She's not naturally funny. She's, I don't know, she's funny when she's trying to be serious. And (laughs) I know that would piss me off. (laughs) Is this directed toward Mama Lynn? Who the hell do you, what? (sighs) Amber is so pretty. I don't know what y'all fronting for. Yeah, okay. Okay, maybe lay off the wacky tabacky hippie stoner, all right? Her in the permanent pout neck looks fake. (laughs) Yo, that's fucking funny. Imagine if she was just like painting the sides of her neck. So from the right angle, like it looks like her neck is the same color as the wall and it makes it look slimmer. (laughs) The fake piercing. I actually saw someone on TikTok that's from the Philly area that I follow. And he was wearing his eyebrow gems (laughs) like that. So, mm, I don't know. I don't know. Is Amber a stan? Less moon, more face. Picasso, I like it. Yeah, okay. You're fucking weirdo, dog. No, I agree. Stop baiting us, queen. She'd have nothing else to live for then, dude. Your hands are so small. (laughs) Okay. She thought she cleared. Cleared the plate. Man, threw away my earrings because they looked like yours. Oof. Choker season. It's been choker season for years now, dude. Catch up. Come on, babe. Expose the cheater. I roll. Oh, (laughs) ma'am. Yo, imagine if everyone started calling her ma'am instead of girly. Mammy pop. (laughs) Yeah, you want to talk about how you're so old, Amber? Well, there you go. You're a mammy now. All right, there's that one. Also, these are in absolutely no particular order. (laughs) Oh, Lord. Remember when she used to stand up and actually dance to these when she was 700 pounds? Now that she's down to 600 or so, she has to sit down on the couch and do them, of course. So she's already on the hunt, you know? She is already prowling the streets again, looking for her next, you know, victim. She's literally the Night Stalker, dude. Ew. Ew. Girl, colliding? No. No. If Amber Lynn were to collide with something, we'd get another big bang. Daddy Lynn. Ew. You're so dainty. Yeah, okay. The eyes eat. Yeah. I'm sorry, girl, but you need to commit to the eyebrow piercing. It would look so good. No, it wouldn't. It really wouldn't. One word. Iconic. Yeah, okay. Oh, pink looks good on you, girl. She's all pink. What are you talking about? Love you, Amber. Queen. Literally, my idol. You notice it's all the same people. Like, literally. And her likes and all that, her views are up there. She gets a lot of views. But she only gets, like, not even 1% of likes. Like, dude. So TikTok knows. So they know. <laughs> You know, there might be a few uh, slow ditzy ones in the comments, but TikTok knows. It's very apparent. You ate this, girl. <laughs> Missed you, Pookie. Pop off, mama. No. OMG, I'm early. Does the queen reply? Say it with me, you guys. Not to you. <laughs> oh, blah, 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 blah. Because she does cringy thirst trap TikToks? 
relax. Um, I mean, no one really needs to relax. Like I've said before, this girl is an abuser. Can't I just compliment someone on my For You page? Well, I mean, read the room. Read the room, all right? <laughs> so many people asking if she replies. My God, my God. I don't know, go get hugged by your dads or something. Like, <laughs> why are you looking for attention in Amberlynn's uh, comment section? Mm, blah, blah, blah. Wow, I actually got the real girl instead of a parody account. Well, ask yourself why there are so many parody accounts. Maybe because girly flop is a parody. Dainty girl. Blah, blah, blah. Why don't you just use TikTok as your workout since you're always doing these cringy TikToks anyways? Well, she was doing that for a while. She said, you guys, I do TikTok dances like a thousand times, okay? I gotta get it perfect. Perhaps I'm just too old for this fetish of looking at oneself in the mirror. It's just a narcissist thing. She got a new wifey. I mean, she always has one lined up. She truly does. And her Valentine, allegedly, if it's real, was all online. So, <clears throat> she probably had other ones lined up. Everyone kissing her ah, in the comments are seriously delusional. No, I agree. I'm rooting for you, but your odds of success are low unless you add in therapy. If you do that, you're... Oz success skyrocket win the fight amber well she's got to beat the fight against herself first okay zaddy land feeling yourself and i'm here for it <laughs> okay madison is that german nine donka that is i don't know what that is okay <laughs> let's go on to the last one you guys this is gonna be a long video Oh my god, the Lana one. Freaking A, dude. First, I'm having to fight against my goddamn life against all the Swifties coming in and loving Lana. Now I'm gonna have to fight <laughs> against Amber Lynn. My god. My god. Listen, I feel like if you don't go through a Lana phase from the age of like... 13 to 14 to about 17 or 18 you just don't get it like you just don't get it <laughs> i'm joking but <laughs> no i'm a lana girly okay if y'all only freaking knew i mean you do i've said it before on here i don't know if i've shared the photo but i have a photo with lana <laughs> i nearly broke a rib to get it all right though so let that be a warning to you guys don't wait 17 hours in line on the sidewalk in montreal um and fight for your life to get front row like just don't do it don't do it I pr it's worth it it is but oh my god you guys i thought i was gonna die okay like i've said it before the swat teams were called in before we had even been let into the venue that's how crazy it was, okay? People were getting trampled. People were getting stuck and smashed in between doors. It was bad, okay? I'm not a, like, physical person. I know I did Taekwondo and all that. They teach you to resort to violence as your absolute last method of survival. You know, I'm not that type of person. I was throwing punches, all right? I was, because people were literally trying to kill each other. It's ridiculous. I know America, American fans aren't like that with Lana. It's a lot more of a relaxed experience for the most part. It still gets crazy, but not to that level. I mean, that was insane. And apparently all of her shows in other countries around the world are like that, you know? I mean, watch her perform down in Brazil, dude. It's freaking crazy. Sorry, Lana ran over. I just love her so much. <laughs> also, like, sorry, I'm going to talk about Lana. Also, I don't want to get copyrighted for the music. This album came out when I was in, like, middle school, dude. Just about to go into high school. Imagine <laughs> how, like, just revolutionary it was. Oh, my God, dude. The whole aesthetic, everything, like driving to maine in the summer just blaring lana with the windows down oh i miss it i miss the vibe so 
I will say, though, I like Lana's older stuff. Her newer music is all right. I still buy it. I have all of her vinyls, but eh, I don't know. And now, mm, here's some tea. Hot take might be an unpopular opinion. I think lately, Taylor Swift has been copying Lana's writing style. Not gonna lie, I do. Because I consider Taylor Swift a pop artist just because of her popularity, how her music kind of like mixes and bends different genres. So I find it hard to plop her down in one specific one, except for just pop. Pop is a good kind of umbrella term for the music that I think uh, Taylor makes. But now she's, you know, starting to switch to like this, I'm a cold brooding artist. I feel emotion so strongly and I write it in my poetry. Like, you know what I mean? Lana very much, her writing style nowadays is very poetic. And I guess you could argue that Taylor Swift has always had a poetic writing style. I would agree with that. But not like this. Like, Tortured Poet Department, I'll be honest, I haven't listened to it. What I have heard, though, it sounds so much like current day Lana, if that makes any sense. I'm gonna lose so many views from talking about Lana Del Rey for nearly 10 minutes. <laughs> Uh, that's a rough one, girl. Rough one. And back in the 700-pound pajama top. Okay. Well, I'm so early. You should get some falsies or lash extensions that look like this filter. It slays with the eyeliner. Okay, whatever. <laughs> I don't care. I've been watching you for so long as I can remember. I've been watching you for as long as I can remember. And you still, you know, haven't caught on? What the hell? You are stunning, girly. Okay. What's your favorite Lana album slash song? Million Dollar Man. That's an interesting answer for this girl. It really is. She she feels like the million dollar man, I bet. She sits there in her bed just like, why is my heart broke? <laughs> oh, girl, please. Okay, girl. <laughs> Blah, 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 blah. So dainty, yeah. I cry every night because I can't spend time with you. I love you. Haley Boo, coming in again hot with another cringe frickin' ass kiss. Lana, she's the queen. I'm not gonna argue with her on that, but Amberlynn is not um, qualified. She was not qualified to wear those shoes. <laughs> She's not qualified to know what a queen is. Love a bit of Lana. Just a bit, girl, please. Wait, the piercing? Yes. <laughs> my friend Michael just got me a cameo from you for my 22nd birthday, and you slayed. I love you. Thank you. Glad you enjoyed. Ew. Ew. Because <laughs> you and I, we were born to die. Yeah, Amberlynn definitely was. She's fast tracking it dude all right if life was disney world she would be in the fast lane girl do you answer dms anywhere i love your content and i think we could be friends maybe oh my god dude what is with all these sad f's in her comment section i mean guaranteed most of them are probably just bots or something but like ugh. and this i believe is her more recent one that she uploaded and the views to likes Dude, the likes didn't even get to, like, the thousands, all right? It's rough. Rough! <laughs> but anyways, you guys, I believe that's the end. Yep. Alrighty. Well, thank you so much for tuning on in, and thank you extra if you stuck around through the Lana rant. I didn't think that was going to happen, but, hey. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't mad about it, so whatever. Anyways, y'all, thank you so, so much for tuning on in. I want to get this edited and sent out for you guys. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Enjoy your Saturday. Thank you so, so much. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments. Like and subscribe. Become a channel member. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Take care.